What's up everybody? This is your boy Phantom Rides back with another moto vlog. I know, I know, it's supposed to be on Monday, but sorry. Getting busy with life. Actually moving to a new place. Alright, thank you guys. Thank you so much for 1000 subscribers. Woohoo! Welcome to all the new subscribers. If you're here since 100, go below and type the real OG phantom OG in the comments go ahead if you've been here since the first 100 really thank you guys thank you guys for all the support and let's just jump into today's topic <laughs> all right guys today I want to talk about some basic tips on how to ride your bike in the summer and not end up dead <laughs> due to sunstroke because it's just getting let's be honest the reason why most people squid and uh, yes you can see around me since I'm in squid city is because everyone is complaining how hot it is how hot it is it's so hot I can't wear my jacket it's so hot I don't want to wear my helmet so number one tip is to have a good helmet like I'll show you my picture here a helmet which has vents to get the air inside and a, uh, for the hot air to exit from behind so invest in a good helmet guys I mean I had uh, previously I was using uh, one of the first helmets that I bought actually when I started motor vlogging was uh, the dual sport helmet by what is that company called and let me be honest guys that helmet sucked it sucked balls okay it's just getting hot so i'm gonna ride inside in the inside lanes so make sure you have a nice helmet uh, second tip is if your helmet if your helmet is like mine so it will have a thing called a breath guard in front which is actually good in the winters and in the monsoon so that your windscreen doesn't uh, fog up but you definitely do not need it in the summer so remove that as well as the chin curtain which again is useful only for winter I see a lot of guys uh, especially guys motor bloggers who are riding in the hotter uh, climates they still have the chin curtain and the uh, the breath guard I don't know like uh, it's supposed to be removed it'll just make your life better guys trust me I'm riding I'm riding like that right now I wish I could show it to you uh, but I can't anyway number uh, three okay again with the helmet make sure your linings are clean because it's breathable material guys you're gonna be sweating a little bit it's okay it's natural so make sure you have uh, all your linings are clean remove them wash them with the non-acidic uh, soap whatever it's called or just water actually make sure you have a good jacket look at this I have a mesh jacket although it's black it has a mesh and trust me guys it keeps my body cool because the wind keeps flowing in I'm not sweating at all um, it doesn't heat up because of the textile jacket I cannot imagine wearing a leather jacket so make sure you have a nice jacket because it's just gonna avoid the heat from um, you know directly hitting your body and inadvertently giving you a heat stroke or a sunstroke or a sunburn also make sure you wear full pants not just shorts although I wear shorts sometimes when I'm riding around smaller neighborhoods or in my own area but even like even if you don't have riding pants make sure you wear good quality jeans because jeans you know like the cowboys have been wearing it for ages it's a very durable fabric watch it where all the couples hang out but there are no couples maybe on the weekend so make sure you wear good quality jeans shoes obviously intersection what happened 
<laughs> don't know the next step and the most important one is to carry some sort of a fluid with you you know water or your choice of fruit juice anything small so that you can keep yourself hydrated guys it's sometimes it can get really hot especially when you're at traffic uh, traffic lights or uh, you know in a traffic situation just a bad traffic situation you can always trust me don't push yourself pull over into a some small shade area and make sure you tank up on the fluids and uh, that was a squid on a KTM with his girlfriend <laughs> is that acceptable i guess it doesn't accept him mom now god knows what <laughs> Uh, <laughs> my bad should have honked that's why i think we honk in india beep 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 another important tip is guys to just actually avoid riding between 12 pm to 4 pm which is probably the uh, around the hottest time because the even the tarmac is going to heat up due to the sun so you're going to have a lot of heat radiation uh, from above and below which is not really good so avoid riding if as much as you can to um, make sure you are safe just a tip obviously uh, those who still have to do it then you should follow my entire all my all my tips uh did i miss anything let me know guys uh what do you think did i miss anything do, is there another tip you would want to add and if you like this video go ahead and share it leave me a like do leave a comment like i said if you're an og let me know you're a phantom og uh, uncontrolled everyone everyone's just like confused i don't know it's probably an effect of the summer and thank you guys make sure you subscribed i will be making two vlogs a week and there is uh, something else that i've been working on which i shall reveal soon thank you for watching again like i said no one sticks to their own side <laughs> thank you for watching guys stay safe and enjoy riding this summer whoop whoop thank you